Hey, Windows experts, do you know that problem when you're just working on your computer and the system is whole, like the whole time lagging, the program is crashing and just like working on a project and you didn't save it. Well, this is like a very appropriate video for you because I'm gonna set up 11 tips or tricks to improve the speed of your Windows 11. First, I would like you to, to introduce to my sponsor, Keysfan. Um, it is about a uh, huge discount on your Windows 10 or Windows 11. If you want to update to Windows 10 or Windows 11, this is just like a great deal to profit. You just go to the description, you just click on the link, and there you will find a huge discount. If you use the discount code, that's also in the description. There's also an option to go to a Microsoft Office pack. Uh, there's also a discount code in the description and you can use that and you'll get a huge discount on that product. So go check it out. Here you see the website of Keysfan. The only thing you have to do is add your product in the cart and you will see the price is still the same. But when you redeem the discount code, you will see the price will be $750, so the discount of 50%. After checkout, you will receive Windows 10. Okay, the first thing you have to do is uh, to update your system. Keep the system updated because like Microsoft is always finding some bugs in the operating system and this will just like slow down your performance of Windows 11. So make sure you're just like checking out if you have to update your system. The first thing you have to do is go to settings and if you open up settings, you will go to the Windows Update tab. If you are there, you can see an oversight of that your Windows is updated. Uh, you can check for updates. Uh, if there's an update, you can accept the license and then you will update the system. The second thing is disable booting up programs. You will see if you're logging in your computer or starting up, you will see some programs or applications are starting automatically with the operating system yeah it will cost energy uh, yeah it will slow down your computer so there's just a way to disable these programs and applications open the test manager and maximize it then you go to the startup tab and then you see an oversight of all applications that are starting up along with the operating system right click on an application to disable it you could also see the booting up time at the right corner the third tip or trick is performance power plan. This is like a combination of system settings, of hardware that just like manage your power plan, just like how much battery you will cost uh, of your computer. Uh, if you're just like changing some figures in it, uh, you will see that it will just like improve and you have the most appropriate uh, combination of file settings and system settings. And that will just like improve your sys, uh, your operating system. The first thing you have to do is open control panel. This is like the old version of Windows. You have to change the menu to large icons and you can see the power options over there. Then you click on open change plan settings. After that change advanced power settings. Put the minimum as well as the maximum figures up to 100%. Okay, the fourth is manage page files. This will this is like an area on your Windows 11 hard disk uh, that uh, use like memory, and this memory will just like. Uh, yeah, determine how fast your computer is. You can just like change some figures in it and it will improve your speed of Windows 11. Open the settings and then you have to search for advanced system. And you will see view advanced system settings. Open in the advanced tab the settings of performance. And there you will go to advanced and change. 
The figures relies on which renders Asus memory you have on your computer. Check disable which figures you have to type in. Under the tab you can also see the recommended uh, figures. So type in the amount at the custom size in megabytes. Click on set and then you have to restart your computer. The fifth is clean this space. Uh, you know, if you just like your full hard drive, there's no space to just like uh, use memory on uh, the performance of Windows 11. So make sure to just like clean up some unnecessary files. And there's just like an easy way to do that. Open the settings and there you will find the storage tab. When you open it, you will see an oversight of uh, categories of uh, the storage. And then you have to go to temporary files. The only thing you have to do is to remove all the files with one button. If you want this automatically, go to storage sense and toggle it on. Sixth thing is remove of effects. Uh, in Windows 11, you see a lot of effects and animations that just like uh, automatically is enabled in Windows 11. But there's a way just like to um, disable these because like it will just like cost a lot of uh, energy and uh, it will just like reduce your speed. Open settings and search for performance and then you have to open performance and appearance. Enable adjust for best performance and voila. Uh, the seventh is uh, pause your OneDrive. OneDrive is just like a hard disk but then online. Um, but OneDrive will sign this in online and offline. If you just have no internet connection, it will cost you a lot of energy and uh, cost a lot of performance. And even if you have an internet connection, it will just like sign on online and offline and that will also like cost performance. So if you pause this, it will just like uh, inter uh, yeah, improve your speed of Windows 11. The only thing you have to do is go to hidden icons and go uh, to OneDrive. Uh, there you go to pause signing and just click on quit OneDrive. The eight is check virus and malware. This is just like an important thing because like if you have a virus or malware, there will be uh, unnecessary uh, pop-ups, uh, unnecessary errors, and that makes the whole performance is like very slow. There's always uh, a yeah, just like a Windows security in your uh, Windows 11 included. This will enable you to do a virus scan. If you do a virus scan, it will just like scanning the whole operating system to see if there are some er errors on malware and it will just like uh, remove it afterwards. If you have another virus scan program, you can also do a virus scan over there, but mostly it is just like included in Windows itself. Uh, make sure you don't have like multiple virus scanners both in Windows 11. This will just like fight against each other and it will cost even more energy. Open settings and then you have to go to privacy and security. You have to open Windows security and over there you just click on virus and threat protection. Just click on quick scan and the operating system will scan itself on errors and malware. The ninth tip is restoring. Windows 11 will automatically uh, making restoring points, uh, points uh, where the system settings are just like on that setup. Uh, restoring will undo uh, eventually pro problems that will cause the slow of your computer so if you go into restoring you will see a restore point and you can go back when the operating system has a virus or something like that you can just go back to the to those uh, restoring points and then it will improve your speed of windows 11. Uh, restoring won't affect your personal file so no worries about that Open settings and search for advanced system. Then you have to open view advanced system settings. Over there you have to go to system protection and there you can click on system restore. You can select the restoring point that is automatically made by Windows. 
Then you have to finish and then the system setting will go back to that restoring point. The 10 is disable notifications. You will mostly see some uh, pop-ups or uh, notification on the right corner of Windows 11. Uh, these will just involve some mails or Google Chrome uh, that will just like let you know some things. But did you know if you just like turn off these things you can just like have a better speed of Windows 11 and uh, especially when you have tips or tricks that's also on the notifications you can turn that off open settings and search for notification and open notification and action settings uncheck the free boxes beneath the toggle system but you can also toggle off all notifications Okay, the 11 is uh, a bonus tip for the gamers, it's just like disable VBS. VBS is virtualization based security and this is a new feature of Windows 11. Uh, VBS will protect your uh, system for unsafe code and malware, but reports have just like reported that uh, it will drop down your performance up to 5 to 25%. So it is better to disable this function especially when you're just game. To start and search for core isolation, the only thing you have to do is disable the memory integrity. Okay, I hope your system is just like faster now. Mine computer is faster now with these 11 tips. If you'd like to see more tutorials of me as a Windows expert, just let me know in the comments. See you later!